Hey everybody, welcome to Bluegrass Heaven. Uh, today we're going to take a look at the G run on the guitar. And this takes place usually in the 15th measure of the song. Most bluegrass songs are 16 measures. The last line of the progression is called the turnaround. It's four measures long. And it's usually G, D, G, G, or two Ds, D, D, G, G. It's when we're going from that five chord back to the one chord. And that one beat of the one chord is the last melody note of the verse or the chorus. And then we're going to start it back again. That's why that line is called the turnaround. So one of the things a guitar can do in that 15th measure is called the G run. And we're going to use, it's, you can do it as a pentatonic scale run. I'm going to use a little chromatic. I'm going to add another note at, not in the uh, pentatonic scale. And it's a one measure lick, and it's going to be the count one, two, and three, and four, and one. And that one's going to be the one beat of the 16th measure. So we're going to play a G note on the sixth string. And we want to use these strong rest picks that we talked about in the uh, rhythm lesson where we pick on the string and land on the string below it. Okay, so we're going to start with a G note. And then the next three notes, we're going to do one pick on the A string, hammer on to the B flat, hammer on to the B. That's why we need that strong pick. And now we're resting on the D string, so we're going to pick the D, hammer onto the E note, and pull off that E note. And then we're resting on the G string, and that's going to be our resolve. So G, A, B, flat B, D, E, D, G. Okay, so there's other ways you can do the 16th measure, uh, what I like to do is I pick that G string, that's our one beat, and then I play the D string, the E note, and the D note back to the G. So one, two, three, four, G. So that covers two measures. So. to practice that, just practice one G chord, one B chord, G run, walk back to G, G, D, G run, walk. All right, well I hope you enjoyed that little lesson there and make sure you subscribe to Bluegrass Heaven. We'll see you guys next time.